Hi, I'm Jim Hendricks, staff editor with the Bonnier Fish Brands, and I'm here at the Fort Lauderdale Boat Show with James Pate of Scout Boats, and we're aboard the 231 XSB. Now, this is a bay boat. Actually, James, I understand you actually own one of these boats. Yeah. And tell me a little bit about kind of the performance you've experienced aboard. Well, this boat is very unique because it is a stepped hold uh, running surface, and stepped holes are something that we've uh, worked with for over 20 years now and just consistently refined uh, step hole running surfaces. This boat is a spin-off of our 231 XS which um, also had the same hull and just the performance on it is phenomenal. Um, the ride, it, it's a soft riding boat. Um, it, it performs right around 60 miles an hour with the 300 Mercury and um, it's very stable fishing platform. So it's one of the best running boats we've ever produced as a company. Excellent. Well, you mentioned fishing, and this is a fishing boat. It's a bay boat, correct? It is, yeah. So why don't you go through some of the key fishing features aboard this boat? Uh, so this is a boat that's a lot of fun to fish on because it has all the fishing features that you need. Um, we've designed it to incorporate a power pole into the back, um, trolling motor on the front. Uh, we've got dual live wells on the boat, so if you've got multiple uh, types of bait, it's easy to split them up and, and put them here in the aft stern. These live wells are also insulated, so it makes a nice fish box if you're using one as a live well and the other as a fish box. As you move forward in the boat, um, we have a large deck to fish off of. New trolling motor technologies have really changed the game in the bay boat world, and this boat can be equipped with an iPilot trolling motor, and um, you just have a lot of fishing space in the front and, um, and also here in the back. So, Well, tell, tell us a little bit about the power that's on the back and the, the, how that enables you to get into, say, some of the shallower waters we would fish in a bay boat. So this boat has a 300 Mercury Verado on it. It's a V8 engine. Wonderful pairing for this boat. Um, Yamaha 300 as well is, is a great uh, motor selection. Both engine packages power the boat to a top speed right around 60 miles an hour. We have an, an optional jack plate on this um, boat, the way it's equipped here at the show. And the jack plate, as you know, can um, change the game on where you can go fishing and, and also the ride of the boat. This boat can, can easily jump on the plane. It's got a draft of right around 12 inches. And um, that draft is actually right at forward um, step on the boat and um, and then actually as you get to the back of the boat it's, it's less than that and so uh, having a step toll and, and the way that this boat is configured it can jump on the plane and uh, with this jack plate and a little over a foot of water and and then as you're running um, the jack plate gives you the ability to really lift the back end of the boat and uh, throw more air under the back side of the running surface and you can skip across the chop um, on this boat and it's really if you're interested in it it's worth experiencing the ride of this boat because it is special. Outstanding. Well so many boats nowadays have to serve more than one purpose and I can tell just by looking at it it's got a lot of comfortable features on those days when maybe fishing's not a priority yeah. you want to take the family out for a day on the water. Well Jim I know you love fishing and I do too um, and and so does my family but yeah, you're exactly right. It's uh, there's some days where uh, where I think I'm gonna fish a lot more than I actually end up doing. And so this boat can accommodate both um, the the day uh, the j the day chasing fish inshore, offshore, and the day just at the sandbar having fun with the family. And so what we've done on this is balance those types of trips, and um, we've got nice seating here in the back. The cushions can easily be removed, stored for those fishing trips. And then as you move forward in the bow, we've got a lounge seat off the front console. Also, the seat cushion can be removed for the day when you're fishing. And then the bow cushions are nice as well, and they're also removable. So we've balanced what we feel, and I, I, I've experienced it firsthand, having owned the boat. We've balanced that fishing boat and the family cruising boat. So. Outstanding. 
So James, I can't help but look at this boat and think about the quality, the fit and finish throughout this boat. Tell us a little bit about what went into it. Yeah, that's one thing that makes this boat really special when compared to other bay boats. Um, we do all of our tooling in-house and actually um, this boat was tooled by the owner of the company and um, he, it was a, a break he took from tooling the 53 um, and took on this project uh, in between another big model. So you'll see features on this boat like the live well lids are literally perfect. And when you shut it, it's just like a high-end car door, like a Mercedes door that there's a difference when you close the door like that. And you'll see that in little features throughout the, the 231. Outstanding. James, thanks so much for taking the time to show off the new 231 XSB. It's obviously a really well-designed boat that I think a lot of people are going to get interested in. Thank you. For the Bonnier Fishing Brands, I'm Jim Hendricks. <laughs>